<clears throat> What's going on YouTube? It's Cannonball Brad here. And today I am bringing you something that I have been looking forward to for a long time. We have a lot of stuff. Special shout out to LA Kappa Customs and Mirror Tactical for really what made this build possible. So thank you LA Kappa Customs and Mirror Tactical. So, oh, there's a lot of stuff to go over here. 5KU um, rear and front sights. I'm not gonna use the rear sight. Lancer Tactical, but steel Infinity style uh, rear sight. Um, they're basically a clone of the Airsoft Masterpiece ones and a little bit cheaper. We have a Lambda 1 G34 inner barrel that I've already put on to my Airsoft Masterpiece brass hop-up unit. We have a 150% nozzle spring on this uh, Waldo Customs. We have the Waldo Customs short step kit. We have the AIP recoil and um, hammer spring. We have the nine ball heat treated grip screws. We have this beautiful steel threaded outer barrel as well that cost a pretty penny. All of this paired with a speed trigger um, with the ball bearings on that one. And the, oh, the edge lightweight blowback housing, airsoft masterpiece guide rod. This is a dual stainless. 4.3. Let's get started. We slide this on. Please be a fit first try. Oh, 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 it's gorgeous. It just comes right to the right to the part where you unlock it. So I can probably put one or two more washers in. Oh, let's take that thing off. Look at that outer barrel sitting super, super nicely. It's all silver and pink. Okay, so upper is done. Let's uh, pull it off. And now we're gonna start with the lower. That's it. I 
think it looks really beautiful. Ace Tech Bifrost uh, X300. I put this flared magwell on it. Uh, fiber optic front and rear sight. And this is the build. Its name, Toborochi. It's a type of tree that is green with uh, pink flowers. The tree bark is green. It has spikes on it and stuff. A really beautiful tree. That is Toborochi. Take care.